under the EtherCAT master. So again, under EtherCAT master, we want to right click, scan for devices. And you can see I've only connected the analog input and analog output module. So it's a little bit different than what's in my project. If you want to see what the actual differences to your project are, you can see this is what's configured in the project and this is what I've actually scanned. Note the Compax 3 comes up as the full V206. This is a beta version of the software. The next version we will remove that and it will only come up as the DS. 402 COE, which is the can open over EtherCAT. We do not want to change that at the time. So what we could do is we can select this, since that's an extra one, and we can delete it. If there was another one that was not actually in this project, we can um, select it and then select copy, select uh, the next one and you can do a copy after or copy before so that will insert it into your project in there so go ahead and press OK I'm going to go ahead and snap in a digital input 8 and digital output 8 now on the left hand side under EtherCAT master you can do a right click and scan for devices Now you can see the uh, new digital input 8, digital output 8. I'm going to go ahead and move that in so I can do a copy after and press OK. And I'll add it to the project.